In this video, we are going to solve the expression x plus 2 multiplied by x plus 3 multiplied by x plus 4 multiplied by x plus 5 is equals to 120. In the first and the fourth factor, the sum of the two numbers is 2 plus 5 which is equals to 7. In the second and third factor, the sum of the two numbers is 3 plus 4 which is equals to 7. Hence, we will multiply the first and the fourth factor together and the second factor which is x plus 3 and the third factor which is x plus 4 together to give 120. So this will help us getting similar values after multiplication. This will help us refactorize these two factors after multiplication. Multiplying x plus 2 and x plus 5 gives us x multiplied by x is x square plus x multiplied by 5 is 5x plus 2 multiplied by x is 2x and 2 multiplied by 5 is 10 plus 2x plus 10 multiplied by x multiplied by x is x square and x multiplied by 4 is 4x so this gives us x square plus 4x plus 3 multiplied by x is 3x and 3 multiplied by 4 is 12 3x plus 12 equals to 120 now this gives us x square plus 7x plus 10 multiplied by x square plus 4x plus 3x equals to 7x plus 12 equals to 120. We can write 10 is 11 minus 1 and 12 is 11 plus 1. So this gives us x square plus 7x plus 11 minus 1 multiplied by x square plus 7x plus 11 plus 1 equals to 120. Now this equation is in the form of a minus b multiplied by a plus b where a is equals to x square plus 7x plus 11 and b is equals to 1. a minus b multiplied by a plus b is equals to a square minus b square. This gives us a square is x square plus 7x plus 11 square minus b square is 1 square is equals to 120. So this gives us x square plus 7x plus 11 square minus 1 equals to 120. Adding 1 to both sides minus 1 and plus 1 will cancel out to give x square plus 7x plus 11 square equals to 121. Now taking square root of both sides gives us x square plus 7x plus 11 to the power of 2 multiplied by 1 by 2 because square root is 1 by 2 and square root of 121 is 11. 2 and 1 by 2 will cancel out to give x square plus 7x plus 11 equals to 11. 11 from both sides will cancel out to give x square plus 7x is equals to 0. Both x square and 7x has x common. Taking x common 
gives x multiplied by x plus 7 equals to 0. Since we have 0 on the right side, either this term is equals to 0 or this term equals to 0. Hence, this gives us x is equals to 0. This is one of our solutions. And for x plus 7 equals to 0 gives x is equals to minus 7. Hence, we have two different values of x which are x equals to 0 and x is equals to minus 7. So these are our two answers. We can also cross check our answers by putting the value of x equals to 0 and minus 7 into the original equation which is now putting x equals to 0 gives 2 multiplied by 3 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 5 which is equals to 120. Now putting x equals to minus 7 gives us minus 7 plus 2 multiplied by minus 7 plus 3 multiplied by minus 7 plus 4 multiplied by minus 7 plus 5. This gives us minus 7 plus 2 is equals to minus 5 multiplied by minus 7 plus 3 is equals to minus 4 multiplied by minus 7 plus 4 is equals to minus 3 multiplied by minus 7 plus 5 is equals to minus 2. This is also equals to 3 multiplied by 2 with 6 multiplied by 4 is 24 multiplied by 5 is 120 and since we have 4 negative signs and 4 is an even number they will give positive value which is plus 120 hence both of our answers are correct which are 0 and minus 7.